Hello, and welcome to another edition of Vanessa's Corner. Today I'm going to show you a real simple trick to make your own Clorox wipes at home, since they are in high demand and kind of hard to find right now. So basically all you need is some bleach, water, and a roll of paper towels, and a container to put them in. Um, normally what I used this time was just an empty coffee can. I painted it uh, to make it look nice. Uh, but you can you don't have to do that or you can spray paint it or um, if you have a coffee container and you want to decorate it maybe we can bring it down to the craft room and get it painted for you but basically all you need is a roll of paper towels if you can get a hold of the stronger cloth like ones like Viva that are really strong those work a little bit better but I managed to grab these at the Dollar Tree so they'll work just fine what you do to start is basically just cut your roll of paper towels to fit inside your container and normally the big coffee can half a roll will work so just be a little careful when you're cutting and just cut that roll of paper towels preferably straight but not a big deal in half and just be careful using a normally what I used was a nice big serrated knife that seemed to work the best cutting these all right so you've cut your roll of paper towels in half This way they'll fit right inside your container just like that next you want to take now the recipe that I am going to leave downstairs at the front desk and outside the craft room door it calls for half a cup of bleach to a gallon of water now that's a lot just to cover these roll this roll here uh, what they recommend is that you can put the rest inside of an empty spray bottle. That way you've got disinfectant for other places. Um, if you want to cut it down, that's what I did. I just used a pitcher of water, two liters, and I cut it down to about a third a cup of bleach. And be careful when you're using bleach. But it is about the best thing to be using right now. Uh, with the COVID virus going around. So you just bleach and some water. Don't drop your lid in. Of course, now it's sanitized. Stir that up just a little bit. Then after you've made your bleach and water mixture, what you want to do is pour that directly over your paper towels inside of your container and saturate them really good with that. That's why you really kind of want to use the stronger paper towels, but in this day and age right now, things are kind of hard to come across. Once you've saturated these really good, then you probably won't use all of this even. Uh, you can just put the rest in a spray bottle to use or uh, use it in your sink, whatever you need to do with. Once you've saturated everything though, then you just take out the cardboard roll that's right in the center. Get rid of that. Then find the end wipe because that's where you're going to pull it up, right from the middle where you pulled out your paper towel roll. And you just simply pull that up. Then you've got the lid of your coffee can. Now what I did, and I'll demonstrate on this paper plate for you, you can just take your knife, kind of stab it right in the middle. 
and then come across again. So basically you're making just an X in the top of your lid, which would be a lot easier with plastic, but so your white can come just right through and dispense to you. So that's what I've done with my lid, made my little X, push my white through, put my lid on, and voila, you have got your very own disinfecting Clorox wipes that you can use at home. So hopefully you've got some bleach lying around. Uh, I do believe we've got some in the store. I even have a little bit here in the craft room if you need it, so feel free to stop by. And this is my helpful little tip for today. Just remember to keep washing those hands, stay safe, practice social distancing. Tomorrow, hopefully, we'll have a special guest with us, and we will also be doing some cooking and baking. And I've got another Easter craft to show you coming up soon. So we are just really enjoying our time here with you. We just miss you all so much. So once again, stay healthy, stay safe, and please, if you need anything, don't hesitate to give us a call. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.